I really want to try it with the mate boost. See how much of a mate boost we get. Hold on. Go like that. Oh! Oh, come on, guys. <laughs> Go Arx Valley Evolved TBF Gaming jumping back into our Primal Fear and Eternal playthrough. Excited to get going today. We're working on a couple things, as always, doing a whole bunch of breeding, a little bit of building, and just kind of a little bit of mess here at the base. Trying to kind of set out the dinos that we do have to kind of get an idea of where we're at in terms of the tiers and in terms of where we're at damage-wise. And just kind of get an idea. I've got our new Indom that we bred that we tamed up in the last episode over here breeding with Millie. So they should have a baby here soon if they didn't already. Let's check. Did you guys already do an egg? Uh, ready to mate, and, oh, oh, they're both female, we gotta see if we can make a potion to change that around real quick, we'll do that in just a second, we got the Indoms over there doing their thing, our Dark Mega Raptor, I'm gonna actually put in the Soul Station to see if they produce anything, we definitely need more of the Dark and Light guys to get a bunch of feathers, but I have been focusing on eating them more than usual, so we do have quite a few feathers over here in storage, I've got Feathers going pretty good. Almost 100 of each one of the feathers. We're doing okay blood-wise. Definitely need a few more different categories there. We're doing okay kibble-wise. We definitely need to make some more of that. On the eternal side, we're doing great. Tons and tons of food. All the stuff made up there that we need. These two are going to breed, but I didn't realize they're both females. We'll put them in a, a station here in a second. We got our Apex Dire Bear that we got recently as well. I want to try that guy out today, and I want a Spino tryout, and we want to try out this guy. So lots of guys that we got to try out from the last episode. This guy as well. So let me clean up all the guys that I know we're not going to really play with today. You might get tried out a little bit. The Hippo we've done in the past. You're my gathering guys. You're my main rider. My toxic guys. What's up? Poison, Poison Thyla. We need some more Thylas too. Eventually, we're going to get the Prince Andrew Thyla as well, hopefully. I know our, our friend has been asking us in the comments when we're going to get that. I haven't seen one other than one time, so hopefully I can get that guy. Our super amazing Apex Phoenix is probably one of my favorites so far this season. Apex Thyla, same thing. Hot Seat's pretty amazing. Dire Bear, leave him out. Uh, Valkyrie, pretty awesome. And I think that's all the ones. I need a saddle for you, a saddle for you guys. So let's do that real quick. So let's go Apex Spino and Apex Bear. I just want to try these guys out. We didn't really get a chance to try them out in the last episode. So let's go ahead and get the Apex Spino tested out and the Apex Bear. There you go. Apex Bear, Apex Spino. We'll get both these crafted up. Try them out just real quick. That's some good armor on those two. And then we need the Owl, which I think is just a regular Owl saddle. Hold on. Owl... Not the Fabled, not the Apex, not the Alpha. Or is it Alpha? Ooh. No. Snow Owl. I think it's just the regular Snow Owl saddle on these Eternal guys, but I'm not 100% sure. We're going to test it. And now I'm not sure at all. All right, so bear first. Let's go try the bear. Saddle. Uh, That's not a bear saddle. Bear saddle. And then Owl saddle. Owl saddle. Nice. We're going to ride Big Blue here. So this will be a saddle for you. And then let's make a relic so I can carry the other guy. So we're going to go relic like that. Boom. And we'll try this guy out real quick. I don't have any taming stuff on me just yet because we're going to make sure that we have these guys tested out. Then we'll come back and get our taming stuff. Just trying to stay a little more focused today. I know sometimes my episodes get a little bit crazy. There you go. Is that going to do the crazy ground thing? A little shoulder spino as we should. All right. Okay. First things first. Let's test out this big guy. Oh, wait. Actually, hold on. Before we do that, I'm going to take these guys with me. Hopefully, I don't forget. Are you rideable already? You are rideable. Cool. There's that guy, that guy, and that guy. Our main damage guy. Take him. We'll come back for you guys. I think we're good. All right. Now, I don't think he fits through the thing, so let's go like this. Now, hopefully, it's not too dangerous out here today. You never know out in front of our base. Sometimes it's absolutely insane. This is definitely one of the craziest death places I've ever lived. Definitely one of the most dangerous. All right. Little Spino action. Here we go. And we should get a, I hope, we're trying to see. Oh, you know what? No, we don't. Hmm. We were hoping. We Someone said that they, they don't. Oh, they don't. Look, because now the mate boost is showing up. Yeah, the mate boost is showing up. But if I put him on my shoulder, it no longer does. Dang, that used to be a thing. Maybe it was a different mod that we did that. I'm going to have to double check and see why that's not working. I know in the past it did, but we'll test that out. But we take a lot of fall damage. Be careful with that. All right. Let's left click it. Let's see. 73,000. Oh, this guy could maybe, maybe take on some big guys. We'd have to get some XP going, but what is that over there? Uh, there's a running something. Let's be careful. He's okay. All right. What kind of rock drake? Prime. Ooh, ooh. 
That's not something we want to mess with. Let's go this way. Let's go ahead and pump a couple levels into health. A couple levels into melee. We'll finish getting you pumped up in just a second. Alright, let's go testing, testing. So 79, and what's our health at currently? We are at 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4.3 million. Definitely need some more there in order to make sure that we're able to take on some big things. But I think this guy could do it. I really want to try it with the mate boost. See how much of a mate boost we get. Hold on. Go like that. Oh! Oh, come on, guys. <laughs> oh, and they're, they're going to be on passive right now. Dang it. Okay. <laughs> That's a good start. So we definitely can't even make it a couple minutes into these episodes. I think I've died more this season than any season in the past. And we die a lot anyways, but it's definitely a little ramped up more this season than usual. All right, and now my inventory is all messed up. Hooray, hooray. Okay, all right. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, like, comment, subscribe. At least hit, hit the like button for me getting killed once again. We seem to die within the first five minutes of every single video. That's why we make the intro so long, so we'll die a little bit less, right? Let's go out this way. Save our spinos real quick. Here you go. Oh, we missed completely. Hold on. No, get away. Okay, there you go. Come on back, come back. Spido, come back. Stop. Stay there, stay there. Okay, nailed it. I don't even know what kind of guy you are. Are you just Primal Fear? I'm not sure. All right, let's try this again. Okay, stay with us. There you go, double Spino attack. Let's see how we do now. Uh, 105, there you go, 105. Definitely a little better. How about if we do the slap? 158. Whoa. -ho -ho -ho. I'm telling you, this guy could be a thing. We might keep breeding these guys just for that fact right there. Because that's pretty good. Definitely a fan. Definitely a fan. Can we kill this mana garmer? No one likes mana garmers. Nobody. Oh, you guys might like mana garmers. I used to love mana garmers. Before they got nerfed, they were pretty amazing. Alpha Enforcer. And Alpha Lion. Definitely don't need those guys. Alright. You should be attacking with us, man. Come on. Neutral. I guess I should have done attack my target, but that'll work. Alright, let's eat your face. That's just a regular RG. I thought it was a eternal one. A little bit of mammoth up there. Oh, you're stuck on us. Come on in. Get off. Oh, we don't have hops. We live here now. Okay, well, let's do a quick switch anyway. I wanted to see what was up there real quick. Anything crazy? Oh, what is that? An origin penguin. Let's not go up there. All right. So Spinos, not too bad. Let's check out our Apex Dire Bear real quick. All right. Let's go ahead and pick up that bag. We're going to pump health a little bit because he's only got 200,000. There you go. A couple million. Awesome. Heal him up. We'll test this guy out real quick. Oh, that's a lot of health. 3.5 million. Nope. Uh, Poison Saber and a... Oh, I guess we're fighting the Poison Saber. Dang it. Uh, that's not really something we should be fighting. This is going to take a very long time. Right click. Right click does 56. But he can knock us out, so be very careful. All right, this was not a fight we should have got into. Mistakes were made. 2.5. Oh, it's taking so long. Okay, he hasn't hit us yet. We're good. Oh, but we're stuck on something. Knock him back. Knock him back. Okay, I'm a little worried. 1.7. We, we can defeat this guy. The problem is if he hits us, he knocks us out. Yep, I know. Okay, we're halfway. Sorry this is such a slow fight. We got kind of dedicated to this one. Okay, he's stuck in the rocks. Perfect. All right, 56 does a little bit better. Let's pump that melee since he's not moving. Oh, I pumped the wrong one. There you go. He's stuck behind the rock. This is perfect. There you go. Hit him in the face. Do I have any XP potions? XP potion. There you go. Give me a couple levels so I can throw him in a melee. Oh, this is perfect. We got that. We got the lucky rock here. This is our new favorite rock. Okay. A little bit of melee. Just increase it just a little bit. 63. There we go. Boom. There we go. Good job, bear. Super bear. Oh. Oh. No. No, 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 no. Okay, hold on. Oh, is he stuck? Oh. <gasps> He's stuck. He's stuck. He's stuck. Uh, this is not the right one to be using. How many darts do I have? Not a lot. 
Oh, jeez, what is that? That looks like another one. No! Hold on. We can regroup this. Okay. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Hold on, I have a Pteranodon. Hold on. Pteranodon. Pteranodon. Oh, God, what is coming now? Oh, God. Okay, here, here, here. Oh, where's your saddle, dude? You don't have a saddle. Got it. Nailed it. Oh, okay, we're okay. Everything's okay. Did that penguin wreck everything? Okay, I don't even know if I can save my bear now. There's so many bad things here now. Oh, my poor bear. Okay, I've got him. I've got him. Take him back. Yep, I don't... Managarmor, go away. Nobody likes you. Knocks out up to including Alpha Tier. All right, we're going to take this guy in here. It's not even a higher level one. There was a higher level one. I just couldn't get to him. Hold on. Literally, we said, didn't we say this at the beginning of the video? Or was that one of the ones I messed up? Oh, no, don't turn on admin mode. Hold on, we, we've got the soul ball out, so we're turning on admin mode on accident. Okay, can we knock you out with this guy, or do I need to get a better guy? No, nope, we need a better guy. Okay, but I have a bear. We've got a bear for this. Okay, land it. Okay, I'm going to go check for the other one in a second. Put that away, because we keep messing up. Basically, if you guys ever see admin mode flash at the top, it's the soul station. If you're an admin on the server and you right-click, it turns admin mode on. It allows you to, like, recover dinos and stuff like that. Very cool. Very, very cool. All right, bear. Where's my bear? Are you a... Yeah, you're a knockout bear. Let's go do it. Okay, hopefully this one works. Does it? We're going to know pretty quickly. Oh. Um, server lag? Uh-oh. No! There it goes. There it goes. Um, no, it didn't. Uh-oh. Okay, this guy doesn't work either. So apparently I'm not going to be able to knock this guy out. I mean, I can maybe use the... I can use the Primal Fear darts. Okay, let's see if we can get that other one. There was two of them over there. We're going to get both of them over here. Come on, lightning guy. Oh, man. That was almost a full-on disaster. We did lose our bear, so there's another dino lost. Let me see if I can recover his bag real quick. Okay, he was over here somewhere. There it is. Is that it? This one. There we go. All right. You go away. I need to hit that guy. Where is he? Come on. Oh, I need to hit this guy. Come on. Almost got him. There you go. Come down to the ground. Oh, I missed. Hit him. There you go. Hit him. Hit him. There you go. I'm not taming him. We're just going to leave him there. We'll deal with him some other time or we'll eat him with another guy. All right. Did the other... Did the other one survive? Oh, <gasps> that's a prime owl. I wish I could get that guy. Get all those. Oh, here we go. Oh, that hurt. Okay. Hold on. Can I knock out that guy? We can't. I don't think we can. Oh, I hit the wrong guy. Did it work? Uh, no. We can't knock out the prime elemental guy. Hmm. And I think he ate the owl. Okay, refocus real quick. So the other Prince Andrew did not survive, right? What happened to the origin penguin? Anybody see it? All right, let's go work on seeing if we can maybe get this guy out here. I think with the apex darts, I can knock him out. It's kind of cheating the system, and I normally wouldn't do this, but because we promised we would tame one of these guys, we're going to do it. He's got 653,000. All right. There you go. All right. We'll knock him out. All right. Go down here and do the thing. We'll throw a little bit of prime meat that I don't have onto him. I think I can grab it from here. A little bit of prime, eternal prime meat. There you go. Grab all that prime meat. We'll tame this guy up real quick. There you go, man. The Prince Andrew. There you go. It only took forever. Okay. Do the thing, man. Uh, do I have a taming potion on me? I do. 
There you go. Prince Andrew, what's up, man? So this guy's really cool. It is a three-legged Thyla. This guy's cool because he's a smelter. Oh, he's knocked out. <laughs> he's a smelter, and <laughs> that wasn't great. He's only got three legs, which is kind of cool. It's a tribute for Irish 240, so they, they made it of his wife's cat. Very cool. We tame this guy every season, but it's usually very late in the season. And by the time we tame him, we don't need him as much anymore. So I'm glad we finally got him a little bit earlier. All right, the unconsciousness is draining out pretty good, so we'll let that go. Can I ride you without anything? We need a saddle. We've gotten this saddle a couple times. Hold on. Stay right there. We've gotten this saddle a couple times this season, but I don't know if we kept it or if I grind, grinded it up. We ground it up. Grind it? Grounded. One of the three. Let's go. If we did have it, it would be over here. All right. And we'll go saddle action. Prince Andrew saddle. There you go. Uh, it's not a good one. I was hoping we had a better one, but... There might have been one in there. I just was doing this quickly. This guy can gather a little bit of everything as well. So let's go check that out. Saddle. Oh, I had one on me. I didn't even need to do that. Toggle smelting ride. Okay, grab all that. Now, let's go check out the gathering on this guy. Got to be a little careful. This is not a crazy level. He's got 1.2 million. He can still climb even though he's only got three legs. Very good. Let's go up here because I think there's going to be some trees and stuff we can gather from up here. I don't remember if he gathers more from trees or, or stone. We'll go test it out. There's trees. Okay, is it safe? What are we doing here? Got to be careful before I jump down in here. What is attacking me now? An alpha shinehorn? Shiny, no. Hold on, are you getting knocked out? Hold on. Oh, I think our, our little aura is actually knocking him out. There you go. Go to sleep, buddy. Little shine shine. There you go. All right, let's see what we gather from now. Okay. Oh, uh, there is a reaper. Let's just move away. There you go. He gathers everything. We gather good from this. We gather good from that. Pretty much everything. We gather from everywhere. We're getting a lot of stuff up here. Holy cow. Look at that. And he's smelting as we go. So we're smelting things as we go. I don't even know. There's so many things going on right now. Incredible, incredible dino. And I think he's got a couple really cool attacks. And I think I think he has minions. Let's test that out real quick. He, gather, he gathers bushes too. Just everything. Literally everything. Pro like one of the ultimate gatherers in this mod. Uh, that's an enforcer. Right. So right click. No. C button. C button does the death beam. All right. X button. There we go. X button does the big explosion of doom. And control should do the minion. Yeah, there's our little minions. Peter. Look at that. And we can have a bunch of them too. All right. Let's send them after this guy. Go, minions. Minions assemble. Yeah, look at the little death cats. Get him. Uh, it's not going to be a good test. Oh, God. Whoa, hold on. That was a lot of damage, guys. Is that the kind of damage you guys are doing? Let's go test it on this giraffe. Oh, even better. Let's test it on that guy. Hold on. There you go. Go get him. 117. Wow, they are wrecking face. Okay, what is it? Control. Oh, lots of control. I don't know how many minions we can have at once, but we'll put them all down there. There you go. Get in there. Everybody in there. Take out the little compy. Did you guys get him? Good job. Okay, you guys are beast mode. I don't know how long they last, but they're pretty good. Okay, let's go up here into the death zone. Alpha dire bear, thorny dragon. I see a rock drake back there. Just a corrupted. All right, let's take out that guy. Go. The little murder cats. Oh, they wrecked. Absolutely wrecked. Now, I don't know if we get the XP or the, the gather stuff for that. I don't really know. Let me see. Let's go a little bit of that. You got any XP potions? You do? Let's give a big one. I wish we would have got the better level one, but this is still incredible. I'm glad we saved it the way we did. Too bad we lost our bear. There you go. Go eat that guy. All right. We're going to eat your face. Gather all the stuff. Oh, what's getting us now? I'm not really sure what just hit me. Okay. Go eat the bear. There you go. Eat that bear. Oh, it's a compi again. Is that the same compi? Hold on. More minions. Oh, we knocked him out. Nice. Oh, a Dreadmorph. Where's the Dreadmorph? 
The Dreadmorph is a nice little dino. Okay. How are we doing on this compi? I can't actually see him. I'm going to assume we're doing okay. Oh, they wrecked him. This guy's knocked out. Well, let's go C button. There we go. Uh, C button doesn't do much. It must do Torpor. I'm not really sure. X button. Pretty good damage. Okay, we'll finish this guy off real quick. See if we get a Prime Megatherium out of it. So good, dude. <laughs> All right, hey, let's go back. I wanted to test this guy out. We don't always get a chance to really test this guy out, and he gathers so much. There you go. We're going to eat all your faces. If a Prime Bills Bufo pops in, I'll definitely tame that real quick. But otherwise, we're just going to jet out. What is over there? A Trick or Treat Polar Dragon. A dragon? A dragon. What do you guys tame with? 3.3 million? Can I do this with my Pteranodon? I don't know if we can, but we can try it real quick. Okay, let's go like that. Let's go like that. Can I pick you guys up? I cannot. Oh, I didn't mean to pick that up with my guy. Oh. Okay. Hey, you guys want to come help me? <laughs> All right, let's see if we can do Torpor to this guy. Uh, Yeah, we can. There we go. I'm going to knock this guy out real quick and see what happens. Oh, what's down there with him? Hold on. Oh, he's eating a Alpha Trike. Gotcha. Oh. Ow. Okay, everybody passive just in case. Oh, good. Uh, Rock Drake. That's what we need right now. Okay, we're going to knock you out, too. All right. A Trick or Treat Polar Dragon. So this guy wants a little bit of meat action. Okay, some meat. Oh, he wants five. Five meat. Okay, hold on. A little bit more meat than that. There's five. Give me that. And a Taming Potion. Boom. There you go. We'll tame you up real quick. I actually haven't tamed one of these guys up this season. We got to get those bags over there too. All right. There you go. Oh. 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 Did you guys see that? It's a trigger treat guy, so it's actually something different. It turned into a abominable apex spino. <gasps> this could mix in with our spino crew. All right. So tame the trigger treat guys because they're basically surprise dinos. I like this a lot. That's really really cool. We will definitely check some of that out. All right. Let's gather all these bags. That's a lot of bags. What do we got here? An Alpha Giga. What is up, Alpha Giga? Uh, we're not going to tame you just because we're, we're kind of above the Alpha tier, although a Giga would be so nice. All right. Let me take a look over here. There is a Glowtail. 16 million. That's a lot of Torpor, man. It says passive. I want to say this is one of those ones that's not actually passive, but I don't remember. I probably... Oh, never mind. Focus. This is the new winner. We're about to upgrade our bird like crazy. Okay, get ready. Please fall to where I can get you. There you go. Okay. Come here, come here. All right. A little bit of prime meat. Just times one, I think it was. Taming potion if we still have it. Yes. Yes. Oh, sorry. You're still knocked out too. I keep knocking my guys out. All right. We'll let you wake up at the base place. That guy we can evolve as well. That's going to be epic. Okay. It says that you want prime meat passively. Let's test this out. Oh, it is. Cool. Let's do that. Come here, little buddy. Pick all that bag up, please. We'll run around this guy real quick. See how much damage he does. He's so fast. All right. How much damage do you do? 18,000. Not bad. Not bad. But he does lightning as well, which is cool. Got a little bit of hops. I think these guys are like the fastest dino ever in the water, I think. Uh, oh, that uh, Shinehorn's still up there. If I remember, we're going to come back for him. Oh, there's another one. Go away, Raptor. Okay, hold on. Where did that Glowtail go? I saw him and I lost him. Let me see if I can find him. Really hard to find. There he is. It is a female 540, and I'm on a male. We're about to do this. Hold on. Hold still. Yeah, I got it. <laughs> there we go. So we got a male-female combo. Look at that. Little Glowtail action. Come on. You can't pass up Glowtails. 
So there you go. We have once again gotten completely distracted. So let's get those guys picked up real quick. Don't pick that up just yet. Let me get my owl out because we wanted to test that guy out. I think that was one of the other ones we want to test out today. All right. Pick that bag up. Thank you. Okay. Let's test this guy out. Now, this is a elemental, so it is a step down from where we're at. But he has a pretty awesome beam. Let me see if I can figure out which one it is. Control. Uh, Well, that wasn't as good as I thought it was. That was actually really, really disappointing. That's too bad. So much less than what I thought it was, but that's okay. Uh, we got a Toxic saber tooth and a Prime Lion. Interesting. Okay. So control is the key on here, but it just does not do any... Hardly any at all. And then left click does about 14,000. It's definitely not bad. Okay. Yeah, I don't know if we're going to continue to breed these guys if this is the kind of damage they're doing. That's really, really not worth it. There's a poison owl. That'd be a nice little knockout guy, but... Other than just a collection guy, I don't know if we're going to continue with these guys. That's some of the lowest damage I've seen on one of these dinos. Alright, oh, what is that guy? A fabled snow owl. Now that guy, if we can save it, I would go for it. Oh, we can shoot off this guy? Never mind, I love this guy. Hold on, let's let him... There you go. Let me go get a little bit of fabled stuff. You stay right there. Two fabled kibble. Let's go. Okay, cool. Yeah, I don't think the owl is something I'll play with in the future. We'll probably just leave this guy inside. He's a collection guy. All right, we'll let you land right there. There you go. It'll eventually, once I can get off of him. Can I not get off? Oh, we got a little bit of lag. So eventually, we might just breed these guys up just for fun, just to get some cool colors on them. But let's leave him here. All that stuff will get pulled off his inventory slowly. My inventory is an absolute nightmare now. We're just going to ignore that for a minute. Let me grab that Fable Kibble for this owl out here. We're going to continue our owl collection. Here you go, Fable Kibble. Give me that. All right. Are you done doing your thing? Almost. Hopefully that'll get picked up the rest of the way. Eventually. All right, we'll let that do its thing. Let's go out and get this Fabled Owl real quick. He's right up here on this rock. Can we get to him again? Oh, I overshot that. Okay. We very much overshot that. I want to go tame another trick-or-treat dino now. That was kind of insane. Oh. Hold on. That's going to be a guy, too. Okay. Let's fly right into him. There you go. Get that fabled one, two, I think it was. There you go. He's going to eat quickly for us. Yeah, he is. There you go. Another owl. Fabled owl. Cool. All right. Now, the big, big thing of the day. We're going to turn this... Pteranodon, there's another one, stop, stop. We're going to turn our Pteranodons into some poison Pteranodons, but I just saw another Prime above us. Hold on, I think. <gasps> it is, look at that, it's a gift from, from above, look at this, a 580 just chilling on our rooftop. Get it, yes. Okay, everybody passive. We're going to go with some Prime Meat. Oh my god, I dropped the Prime Meat, didn't I? Oh no, it's on my thing, there it is. And then we're going to go with the Taming Potion. Boom. There you go. Get that back before it eats it all. <laughs> He's still eating it. Stop it. Give me the stuff. There you go. Okay, so that is a 869. Let me see what the level of my two Prime Tyrandons are. 839 and 869. They're both female. We're going to have to fix that. I think we can change that. And let's go ahead and... So it looks like today is mainly a Eternal Day. Uh, where's my door here? Let's go in the back door. We'll just leave this back door open a little more often. These are our guys that have died and we recovered. We can't use them anymore. They're just kind of hanging out back here. There you go. Close that guy. Close that guy. Still not doing your thing? Oh, just those last couple things. We'll take those. All right. Let me see if we can make a potion inside of the eternal bench to switch these guys from male to female real quick. So we'll go like that. It is 50 DNA, which we have. Five Mijo Berry and one Scissor. Probably need to make the scissors. Let's make some scissors. There you go. Some scissors. We're going to need a couple of these. And I might need Mijo Berries. I didn't start the Mijo Berry farm like we had planned. But let me hurry up and get this. All right. 
There's another one, another one. There you go. And then we make it inside here. Okay, so throw the scissors in there. And then we make the potion. And we do a quick quick thing on the indoms and a quick thing on these two prime pteranodons. And we get these guys breeding like ASAP. In fact, I'm going to shut down the owls because they are the most disappointing dino we've had so far. They're going to be great for collections, but not really great otherwise. And then the pteranodons, we're going to throw down both prime pteranodons. And we're going to do a quick double breed. So we're going to go like this. Prime pteranodon and prime pteranodon. So we're going to turn these guys on breeding just real quick. Enable mate. Enable mate. Boom. And then we're going to go like this. We're going to flip it. And then boom. Those two will mate real quick. Should only take a second. There you go. Very nice. That A got picked up. Then we're going to go ahead and flip it like this. One. And. Two. Two. Boom, they're going to do another egg. So this is going to give us four prime pteranodons to throw in a mating station like immediately. And that's the whole point of doing it like this. So we'll go, there's the one egg. Where's the other one? Feel free to pick the egg up. Come on, guys. Okay, I'll pick it up, I guess. And we'll throw this over here. And we'll let that, just for a second, do its thing. Let's see if we can make a couple more pair of scissors. And a couple more of this potion. One, two. There's three. And the fourth one. All right, then we'll make four of those again. And we're going to do the same thing with our prime indoms. So we'll have those guys also. So we're going to get those guys breeding up like crazy. But there you go. These guys will be thrown in the little station here in just a second. We're going to do all four of those. Okay, you guys did amazing. Good job. We'll get the other two. Where are they at? All right. Pteranodon egg. One and two. Nice. We got a 869 and a 844. So the 844 is going to be flipped to female also. So now we throw these guys down here. And then if we can make it, it's a little expensive. Little baby pteranodons. If we can make it, we throw it, we go in here and we make the dino steroids. This is unlocked by, oh, do I not have it unlocked? Oh, oh. I might not have unlocked it yet. I've gotten it from drops. Oh, we got to, dang it. We have to, okay, we can't do that until we actually get, okay, so no. But we can make a grow up potion, I believe. Grow up potion is just ground beef and stamina potions. So we go stam. Stamina potions. We're going to need a nice stack of that. Oh, crap. We're not going to have enough. Okay. Yeah, we, we're going to need... We need... In order just to make two of them, we need four ground beef potions and 19 stam potions, which means we need stem berries. Okay, well, you guys are going to have to wait. But we are going to eventually put all of these guys inside the station there. Let's go ahead and do the same thing with our indoms. Indom. Okay. Indom 1 and Millie. Millie. Okay, Millie. We're going to go like that. Okay, let's put you on mating. And mating. We'll flip the switch real quick. Oh, we already put one in there. My bad. There you go. Let them breed real quick. Drop out that egg. Nice little invisible egg action. Then we're going to do the same thing. One... And I don't know. I hope there's not a timer on this. I don't think there is. Boom. There's not. We, we just tested it a minute ago. My bad. There you go. We got two more eggs. And then we're good to go. And Millie is still our female. Perfect. So now we go in here. And we go with these Indom eggs. Throw those in there. Oh, this is going to be huge, man. It's going to be absolutely huge. And then we'll have an actual... We're going to get ourselves an actual... Uh, mated pair, or a couple pairs of them, and then we'll start getting a whole bunch of imprinted ones. It'll be pretty incredible. All right, Apex Thylas, you guys are incredible, but I think we're going to take a break on breeding you guys. There we go. So this is going to be Phoenix still. This one will be the Pteranodons. All right. 
prime pteranodons, sorry, prime pteranodons. So we got one and two, and then I'll wait for you two to grow up in about 40 something minutes. I don't think we can, can we push the issue? No, we can't, okay. All right, we gotta wait, just wait on that. I'm gonna, I guess just get these two started. No, because they gotta wait a while to, they got about the same, so we're just gonna wait on that. I'm just gonna put them in there so we don't forget about them. Let's go over here and hatch our new indoms. One and two. There you go. Boom. All right, let's see what we got out of that. Oh, we got twins on one of them. There you go, 1012 and a 991. Looks like they got kind of bad stats across the board, but we'll get that cleaned up inside of the actual breeding thing. All right. And then we'll throw these two indom. We'll throw all the indoms on this one so we don't forget which ones we're doing. I don't know why I just did that. Type it on this side. One, two, three. Not the not the sheep. Just the Rex. Although it let all of them go in there. That was really weird. And then Indom. Need these three here. Just so we can put them over there and not forget about them. Alright, uh, let's get let's go out again. We'll get a saddle for this other guy in a second. So if I if I leave that other Indom in there, does what's gonna happen? Hold on. Is it going to let me? Okay, they got to be the same creature. So I don't know. It, just, it let me put it in there. So I was just checking. All right. Uh, and I guess just in case I forget, we'll go ahead and just get these guys started. Even though they got to recover before they're going to get going. There you go. They're already doing their thing. And prepare, start, to start. Boom. Just in case I forget, that's already going. All right, cool, man. That is actually really, really good. Man, so now the next thing that I need is I need to start making artifacts. So I was wondering if we could take out a Bionic Giga, but I don't think we can quite do it. But I don't know. We'll have to test it out. Last thing I want to test out today because we didn't get a chance to do this is someone told me to test out the other attacks on the Midnight Shadow a couple days ago, and I didn't get a chance to do that. So let's do that real quick. So obviously left click is the crazy 1.7 million damage. Right click is... I think he's trying to grab things. C button. Oh, there you go. 3.9 million. Okay. X button. Uh, I didn't see what it actually did. Hold on. Do it again. Uh, I don't know if it's doing damage or not. I can't tell. X button. Doesn't seem like it is. Control? No. So I think C button is the way. Yeah, C button's the way. Looks like it does some crazy attack in front of us. A prime trike? What? Oh, if the prime trike wins, we might go after that prime trike real quick. There's a lot of things knocked out over here. Get that guy eaten. Oh, the prime trike did not win. Those megatheriums are too tough, man. Okay. Wreck your guys' face. Very nice. All right, we got a couple space pandas over there. If one of them turns into a shiny, I'll go after him. Otherwise, we'll ignore those guys for just a little bit. Oh, there's that. There's the penguin. Can How much damage can we do to him? Uh, We could do it, but that would take a very long time. We'll wait until we get a little bit bigger and better guy. Our Apex Phoenix might be able to do it. There you go. We're going to eat all your faces real quick. Come on. There you go. Oh, we got a robot quetz out of that. Awesome. Oh, what killed me? I'm not really sure what killed us. Okay. All right. Quick regroup. Let me get my stuff back. We'll go get the stuff. I think we're pretty good today. We did get a couple really cool tames today. We'll check those guys out here in just a second. Let me go desert cloth. We'll jump out the door. Come on. There we go. All right. Let's go save our buddy real quick and figure out what in the world killed us. I don't know. Everything is dead in the area, so I'm not really sure. Oh, oh, a resurrected Quetzal. Oh, not cool. Okay, we need to get on a dino that can keep us safe real quick. Let's do, let's get our Apex Phoenix out. We'll go just clear that area out real quick. All right, where's our buddy Apex Phoenix? 
We need to get some names on these guys too. We'll go like that. 1323. This guy's so good. This is definitely our best dino so far in terms of total damage. Uh, although some of our eternal guys are going to start catching up to this, especially that Indom. All right. Let's just go start wrecking some face. There you go. Boom. That's <laughs> so good. I'm going to eat your face and your face. Thank you. And then let's see if we can clear out this uh, guy giving us trouble over here. Come on. There you go. Did I get it? We got it. And Prime Megatherium too. How much health did you have left? You got plenty. This guy's a tough guy. Okay, we're going to get your bag back. We're going to pick you up. All right, there you go, man. I think that's a pretty good episode today. We got quite a bit done, even though there's still a lot more things we need to get done over the next several days. We're starting to really make some progress into both mods. I'll try to get a little more focused on Primal Fear in the next one. It's definitely been a lot of fun to kind of go back and forth between the two mods and, and try out a little bit of each. We did get a Fabled guy today, which is good. Robot Rex would be kind of cool, but we're not quite there yet either. Uh, that Penguin would be awesome, but that has a lot of health. And I don't know if he can hit us from down there. That's what worries me. Let's see if we can do it. But we can maybe do this. Let's do it. Take on our first actual official primal. Just hang out above them like this. Just keep spamming C button. We're going to do it real quick. Here we go. Last hit. The origin Karuku is about to go down. Here it is. Oh, did I miss? Uh, No, we got it. We got him. Yes. That is our first time taking one of those guys out this season. Oh, not you. You go away, Mana Garmer. Nobody likes you. Oh, I don't know what's flying up here now. All right, let me just get rid of this guy here. Come on, one more time, C button. Come on. Please get rid of this guy. There we go. Get rid of that mana armor. Let's pick up all these bags, and we'll head back to the base place. There you go, guys. Not a bad day. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Like, comment, subscribe. Huge shout-out to the patrons for making all these servers possible. Huge shout-out to you for checking this video out. I really do appreciate it. Oh, the mana armors, man. They're just everywhere. Super trolling. There we go. Back safe at base before we get that <laughs> ended out today. But I do really appreciate all the support. Huge shout out to everyone who's checked out the channel recently. We had a bunch of new members over on Patreon and on YouTube memberships. Thank you so much for that. That's what really supports the channel and makes it to where we can make a bunch of these videos and continue to run a bunch of these servers for the patrons. Seriously, thank you. I hope you guys had a great day. Have a great week. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much. Later.